welcome to Madrid, <laughs> Madrid house. Well, as you in Cornell, we have to create a, a design for us to collect all the solar energy we could. Uh -huh. So what we thought for this edition, because we were in the 2005 edition, it was to create a simple house. So we decided to create a single roof with a pitch of 32 degrees uh -huh. and have a all set of PV panels to collect uh, energy. That's for electricity. For plumbing, we have evacuated tubes. These tubes that you can switch the angle because some are fixed. We have movable, so we have evacuated tubes in vertical, at the right side of the southern facade, and in the roof. At the top of the roof, we have some other because we want to set an absorption machine for cooling and heating the house. But for the con for contest issues, we went for a heat pump. Now about the materials inside the house, some of them are recycled materials, like these are almond shells, etc. Ah. These kind of woods are something recyclable. I don't know what it is. <laughs> and for flexibility issues, we all of our furniture is movable. We have wheels over the table, over the shelf, so we can move spaces. If you have a dinner, we can move maybe the shelf up there and make a bigger space. This living room, you can move all the furniture and, and have a, a bed for a, for a guest or something like that. Our appliances are German-made, are called Siemens. They are the, some of the most efficient in, down in Europe. I don't know what else are you interested in. How about I can tell you about watts, kilowatts, hours. Go for it. <laughs> well, our system is pretty basic. We have the panels. Afterwards, we have a charge controller. Well, we have the fuse of 24 batteries to store energy, or and we have the inverters to convert the energy from DC into AC, and we go. To in 230 volts and 50 hertz, that's European uh, voltage and frequency. And